after the season, obviously. It was something that we didn't even entertain during the season because we both had to focus on trying to win the Super Bowl. Obviously, that was um, A number one. But once the once we wrapped up the season, you know, started communicating a little bit, um, still didn't really fully dive into it because we kind of wanted to decompress from the season, allow each other to, you know, put our thinking caps on a little bit and see where we were. And then, um, you know, as things progress a little bit more, obviously we communicate, um, you know, multiple times a week as it is, you know, aside from even trying to team up. So um, once we got to a point where it was it was something that could be realistic now, it's not just a, you know, a thought. Um, we started trying to put a, a little bit of a plan together. And, um, you know, obviously I was still going back with Green Bay at that point and still, um, you know, weighing my options. But um, I think we got to a point where uh, I felt like it was a it was it was a good move for us, and um, you know obviously I was traded, so it wasn't wasn't just strictly um, you know on us, but from you know I grew up in East Palo Alto, so being I was a Raiders fan my whole life, so it is a dream to be a Raider, man. So it's a it's a it's dream come true. Um, in the third grade yearbook, I said I wanted to be a you know an NFL star or an NBA star, and I was wearing a, a Charles Woodson jersey at the time, so. It's been documented forever, so you know. I guess you could say it's meant to be. I mean, the turning point was really when I had to sit down and, and figure out what was best for for me and my family. It wasn't really, it wasn't just the teaming up with Derek. It wasn't you know something that we like. I said we didn't scheme this you know all, all season or whatever. We just you know kind of checked in on each other, football wise. The rest, I mean, we check in on each other all the time about family and and the the real stuff. But as far as football and getting together. Um, you're not being a great teammate to you know your current organization if that's all you're worried about. You know he had to worry about getting the ball to Hunter and and Darren and, and and those guys and being a great teammate over here. And I had to you know do what I could to try to you know get to a Super Bowl. And obviously that didn't happen for either of us. So once we got to the point where it was it was real, we started entertaining it. But um, yeah, it, it ultimately it was just for for my family situation. You know I got another baby on the way, so. Um, you know, quality of life obviously is is a is another piece of it that that means a lot to me, and um, you know, I have a lot of family in, in you know in California that's never been to see me play before. Grandparents, uh, my my grandmother wasn't doing well; she was in the hospital recently. So, just kind of reflecting and thinking about life things and stuff that really matters in this world. That's stuff that matters to me. Um, you know, that's stuff that's weighing on my mind when I, when there's a decision to be made. You know, do I want to be able to go through my whole career without having either of my grandparents, um, you know, on either side um, see me play. And I, I didn't like that. So obviously being in Vegas, it gives them a much better opportunity. My dad drives everywhere. So to be able to make that happen, it's a little harder to drive to, to Green Bay. So um, yeah, man, it's a, it's a dream come true to be able to do this thing and, and ultimately get it done. So I'm, I'm happy with where we are. How quickly do you think you and Derek will pick up where you left off? Well, I mean, mean the the thing is, we've been training up in, together every off season up until you guys moved out here. So we've been, I mean, it's been like two years that we, you know, haven't two off seasons that we haven't gotten to at least throw, you know, for three four months. So um, hopefully, it, I don't want to make any promises. I'm I'm sure it'll be we'll pick up where we left off pretty quick. But uh, yeah, we got two two guys that work really hard. Is you know makes it a lot easier. The thing that I attribute all my success to is just living in the moment and, you know, playing each game is really corny and really basic. But when, you know, in college I, I did well, I got to the league, but I didn't even think about the league. I just went and played, had fun, took every game, um, you know, one by one and, and just thought about stacking it. I, it was a one game season every time. They talk about how long the season is. Season ain't that long. I don't believe that. I think the season's pretty short, honestly. 17 opportunities for all the work you put in all year. It's not that long of a season, so for me, I attack it. Um, you know, I'm in the I'm in the business of maximizing everything I do, so um, definitely uh, looking forward to, like I said, leaving my footprint, doing everything I can to, you know, hopefully, allow this team to win a lot of games.